Hello, my name is Carlos Mafessoni. I'm a chemical engineer, and I present you a study involving microscopy of ion exchange resins. Thanks for watching. Hello, technicians and engineers. We are talking in this video about microscopy of ion exchange resins. The purpose of this study is show how uh, resins is mainly in morphology, size, and what happened after use. All images used in this video uh, were not taken from internet. We used to make this video a Nikon Labofot microscope with a 20,000 times objective Carl's eyes and a 40 times objective Nikon. So, microscopy helps you evaluate conditions of resin see if the grade promised by manufacturer matches or if the resin is or not at the point to be replaced by another one all ion resins shown in this video are of the type sec strong acid cation okay we start this study showing a common sec resin. It's a non-uniform grade. It's a common grade. You see the vari variation between diameters of the spheres. In this grade of resin, diameter varies between 300 micrometers and a thousand and two hundred micrometers therefore is a large variance between diameters here we have a uniform resin you can see a regular format of the spheres we measure diameter and uh, we found 520 micrometers you can notice a very small variance of diameters this is a better quality resin and obviously a higher price one it gives a better results uh, reducing losses of resins th through uh, drains and crepins. Here we have another brand of resin, a kind of a uniform resin. We measure and the results was 530 micrometers of diameter. The most of measures. Recently another brands have entered the market. This particular one is a, a different kind because it has no yellow color or amber color and the diameter is larger, something about 800 micrometers. It does not mean this kind of resin is worse or better but you have make tests and try to use different kind of resins to the in the end you choose the better one coincidence or not this kind of resin is cheaper what do you think this another type is a not a uniform resin but is a special type because manufacturer promises this resin removes iron and manganese 
in large amounts in in water remember to remove iron and manganese from water is not recommended softening is better a oxidation and filtration metals in water can bridge and clog the resins because of that softening is not recommended for remove metals anyway you can use resins for that but be careful the sales champion of resins are a, a common resin not uniform it has a, a very good cost benefit and softening is a, a main use of ion exchange resins so a common resin SAC strong acid cation is the main main produced main consumed in the world we change our study to watch a used resins you can see in the video a clogged resin some spheres are very dark you can see fouling this resin is probably in the point of be be uh, replaced or even you can try uh, a cleaning using uh, muriatic acid but uh, it depends of the taking place the grade of contamination okay another example of clogged resins you can see some spheres very very dark another less uh, a dirty take it place so this resin must be cleaned or replaced by another new I hope you had liked this study and I'd like to see you in other videos of our channel. Thank you very much.